This is Bad Kissingen in Northern Bavaria and this is the 4x4 off-road show Abenteuer und Allrad. It's a great place to come. Lots of uh, camping vehicles here. Well, it's the largest camping uh, off-road uh, fair in the world. This is an action mobile of which a number of people have asked me to film. As you can see, it's on a man basis. The habitation area is 755 centimeters long by 247 wide by 379 high, that's the entire height, uh, which carries uh, two times 400 litre diesel and 720 litres of fresh water and uh, waste water, uh, 230, 1440 watts of solar, 720 uh, watts of battery power, battery capacity I should say. Right, so got some brief facts there. You'll be wanting the price for that, you'll, you'll have to get that on application. Right, so up there we've got a place to, to keep your motorbike. Now, a couple of things here, I'm not quite used to the camera yet and I've put the setting for indoors. So I hope this isn't coming washed out. Of course I can't check it as I'm filming. Right, so uh, the electrical capacity, of course, for something like this is of great importance. And we have in there those batteries I mentioned earlier. So now let's have a, a walk inside. Now, when I mentioned the, the, the price, of course, these things are built to order, so you get what you want. And if you don't like something, you don't get it. Handy place to keep your shoes. Every motorhome should have one. Stop you bringing the mud into the van. So if you don't like the layout in this vehicle, you can have it built some other way. It's as you want. So in this case we've got two bunk beds here. We've got a double bed at the back with a fantastic skylight up there. Well it's not really a skylight, it's more of a hatch than a skylight and uh, things, you've got, you've got a place which are pretty hot in any case and uh, you'd have the uh, mosquito net down at all times or oh, see some insect got in anyway well, of course the doors are open security windows which uh, you'd need in the places you like to go with something like this and they're on both sides got lockers above the beds, all the way around. Now there's a look down the gangway. Okay, we'll have a look on the left here. Comes out towards me. And there, glass door. Coming further across. Fridge. Doesn't look like a fridge, does it? In fact, I wouldn't have known that was a fridge if I hadn't seen it opened earlier. Got your electrics. 
up here, see there, warm water heating one and two, fridge, in here, you've got your uh, hanging space. I see it's also been used, but there's a lot of people here on this, uh, the uh, exhibitors have got uh, their own um, camping area, and some of them are even sleeping in the vans which are on display. Which is great, I think. Uh, I'm in town a bit. Uh, I, I, I'm on the uh, uh, the uh, how should I put it? The, no, the visitors' car park. So our car park camping area. So uh, basically, you know, it's a fantastic trade fair. This one. I've said this in other films, but it, it's really brilliant. This great time of year to be here. Anyway, back onto the what we've got here. So we've got a Miele oven there. No, the, the uh, heating and the uh, cooking is electric, but you know the 1.4 plus kilowatts of uh, solar, and um, you know, that that should really take care of what you need with the battery power and everything. Now, and that is the entrance there to the cab up front. You've got a little bit there of additional storage I see under the table and up here is another way of getting onto the roof should you so desire. So, what do you think of that? It's a big van. Hard to park. Well, unless you're in the desert, probably parking's quite easy to suspect. So, that's giving you a little bit idea of this vehicle. Now, let's go and see some others.